Hello and welcome to Arkansas Children's Hospital. I am Rebecca Brockman and today I'm joined by Angela Glover. She is our patient care manager in the CVICU, which stands for Cardiovascular Intensive Care Unit, which of course is a mouthful if you're not used to saying it, so I'm gonna be referring to it as, as the CVICU. Um, and we are here today because uh, this unit recently received the Silver Level Beacon Award by the American Association of Critical Care Nurses. Again, another mouthful, but Angela is gonna help us understand exactly what it means for patients and families, most importantly, most important, and then what it means to the hospital. But first of all, Angela, we, we wanna talk about the award, of course, but we wanna talk about what goes on here at the CVICU for patients or families watching who have not, have not been here before. Okay. So what happens here? So we're a 30 bed unit. Okay. Um, we specialize in anything cardiac. So cardi congenital cardiac defe defects, acquired cardiac conditions in anything after the neonate period. We also specialize in arrhythmias and um, any kid that has to have, be listed for transplant for any reason. So we take care of them before, during, and after their transplant. And then we also have the cardiac cath lab downstairs. So any kid that needs a cardiac catheterization for any reason, will come to us to recover, as well as our CVOR, which is located just outside of our unit, so it's easy access. So we take care of kids that need cardiac surgery post-op and then um, from the time they arrive to the time they go home. So you do a lot. We do a lot. <laughs> Anything that has to do with hearts, and it's a little different here because you care for patients, like you said, from newborn, teens, and even adults. Yes. So anytime someone is diagnosed with a cardiac defect or any sort of acquired condition, once they are diagnosed, we see them throughout their lifetime. So when we have a new baby who is diagnosed with, say, hypoplastic left heart syndrome, which is a, which is a defect that requires three palliative surgeries, once they're diagnosed with that, they'll come in, have their first surgery, and then go home, and then come back a little later, have their third surgery, and then we follow them throughout life. So as their life progresses, they'll be regularly seen in our cardiology clinic downstairs, and then anytime they need any sort of inpatient service, they'll come to us. So we see them through teenage, through adult years. Okay, so it is, it's, it's a yes. very special unit. So you get to know your patients throughout their entire life yes, almost. Yes, absolutely. Kind of get to see them grow up, which is really neat. That's, that's excellent. Um, so now let's talk about the award, which of course is, is exciting, um, especially because we are, uh, the CVICU is the only uh, unit in the state to have received this award. We're the only CVICU in the state that has received the award. We joined our, we joined Arkansas Children's PICU as the second ICU in the state to have received the award. Um, so it's a, kind of a very special thing. It's nationally recognized um, for units who really kind of set the bar for excellent care. And only 49 CVICUs across the U.S. have received this award. So it's really neat that we are, and really exciting that we are recognized for the work that we do. So awards are nice, but why is it important um, to the hospital and to this unit? So Beacon, like I said, is a national recognition and it recognizes the units that really set the bar. So to be recognized as that unit who is striving for excellence and striving for excellent patient care and family-centered care, um, it really kind of takes us up to the top. So now all of our patients and families will know that we um, really strive to keep our patients safe, like our patient outcomes, prove that we have done everything in our power to keep our patients safe, um, and that we kind of include all disciplines in our care. So we, our interdisciplinary team rounds on our patients daily, and that includes the bedside nurse, the doctors, the APRNs, but as well as nutritionists and pharmacists and whoever else we think needs to be involved in care to give that patient everything that they need to succeed. So, and you just touched on this a little bit, for patients and families, what does this award mean? So, I think it just confirms that we are truly committed to them and truly committed to delivering the best possible care that we can. Um, it also highlights our involvement in the community. 
So we are involved in a lot of different ways in the community, but it focuses on the fact that we're not just dedicated to our patients who are here with us, we're also dedicated to the patients that may be out in the community that are undiagnosed. Excellent. And last question, um, thank you for your time. How is the patient experience different here at the Arkansas Children's CVICU? So I would say that Beacon hasn't changed the patient experience at all. We have always delivered really great care. It's just now we're recognized for it. So we always strive to better ourselves every day. So we have a great team who is constantly doing research and finding new evidence-based ways to better care for our patients. And we're just gonna keep continuing to do that and keep continuing to try to improve. That's, that's awesome. Well, thank you thank for your you. time. Thank you for explaining the Beacon Award yeah. and what it means uh, most importantly to our patients and families. So uh, thank you for watching. If you have any questions for Angela or what goes on in the CVICU, please leave a comment below and make sure you get answers. So yes. thank you and congratulations. Thank you.